Hello everyone. Question number five is: Class nine student of a certain public school wanted to give a farewell party to outgoing student of class ten. They decided to purchase two kinds of sweets: one costing rupees seventy per kg and the other costing rupees eighty four per kg. They estimated that total sweets or thirty six kg of sweets were needed. If the total amount or money spent on sweets was rupees twenty eight hundred, then how much kilogram is the first kind of sweets and how much kilogram is the second kind of sweets? Now suppose the first kind of sweets is x kg which they have purchased, and the second kind of sweets is y kg which they have purchased. So here we can finally come to the equation x plus y is equals to thirty six. Because they are purchasing total 36 kg of sweets. Another equation is the costing of these sweets. So x kilogram of first kind will cost 70x. Because it is, if it is 70 rupees per kg, so x kg will cost us 70x plus. Second costing will be 84y because here we are purchasing y kg and the cost is 84 rupees per kg and here the total amount is 28. So these are the two equations we have found. Now we know that we have to either put the value of x or y in the second equation, or the best way is to eliminate one of the values. So we multiply the first equation by 70 because x coefficient should be equal. So the first equation becomes 70x plus 70y is equals to 70 into 36. If you multiply, it comes out to be 2520. The second equation is 70x plus 84y is equals to 2800. This already we know. So if we subtract the two equations, this can be cancelled out. It is minus 14y is equals to minus 280. If we calculate, we get the value of y is as 280 upon 14, and that is rupees 20. Sorry. 20 kgs so we can say the quantity of second kind of sweets is 20 kgs if we put it in the first equation then the first kind of sweets plus 20 kg is equals to 36 kgs so the first kind of sweets will be 36 minus 20 and that is 16 kgs so this way we can solve it by simultaneous equation but I would like to tell you one more thing that it is very very easy for us if in case we don't want to follow this procedure and want to tell this question orally then what we can do we say that suppose the total 36 kg of sweets we have purchased of the first kind suppose now the total cost will be 36 into 70 and that is 2520 If in case we purchase the total sweets of the first kind, then the cost will be two five two zero. But actually, the cost is twenty eight hundred. That means the cost is two eighty rupees more than what if we purchase for all the first kind of sweets. Now, suppose I replace one kg of sweets of the first kind with the second kind of sweets, then the Weight will remain the same. Seventy. This first kind of sweet we have taken out one kg and we are adding one kg of second kind of sweets. So the quantity will remain thirty six, but the price will increase by rupees fourteen because the difference of the two price is rupees fourteen. Same way, if the price difference is two eighty, that means two eighty upon the price difference of rupees fourteen. Will be there if we replace it by the second kind of sweets, and when we cancel it, it is 20 kgs. So second side, first kind of sweets we have to replace by second kind of sweets, and that will be 20 kgs. It means that the second kind of sweets is 20 kg. Automatically, the first kind of sweets will be 16 kg. This way, we can solve this kind of question orally as well. If in case you have any problem, you can contact or email us. In the next class, we will talk about question number six onwards. Thank you.